Come on, take a poop. I'm just gonna stop the plant that was knocked over. Good body! Okay, so I'm gonna start using this camera for vlogging because I have it, so I might as well use it. Um, so today a dude came and we're going to see about getting our roof um, like waterproofed. Focus camera. Um, so we're the ones on the fifth floor, that's our responsibility, but we've been trying to do it for like a couple years. I think it's been like a year and a half because we got it done once. Um, no, we got it done twice. The first time we got it done by some dudes at Home Depot and then it's still, the roof still leaked. And then we got it done by some other dudes at Home Depot. And then it still leaked. And so we had to talk to some people at um, like a, not a hardware store. They like specialize in paints and um, waterproofing. And we asked them, okay, what do we have to do so that it stops leaking at least for at least a year because none of these ones that we've been doing lasted even like a year. The moment it started raining it would be like one, two good rains and then it would just leak all over again. So we talked to them and they told us well you have to put a net down and then with the net it should hold up because we live close to the rail, close to the railroad, so the train goes by and everything shakes, so that just causes it to crack, <sighs> and it becomes a problem. So the guy came over and he measured the entire building, because originally he originally we called him so that he would waterproof the whole building, because it's starting to leak. And when I mean the whole building, I mean this and that, both of it. So he came, he took measurements, he looked at the, at the roof to see how, how it looked, how it was. And he said that he's going to check on materials for the building and he's going to tell, call us, if not tomorrow, the next day, so that we can split the bill between everybody but you know it's just something that we have to do we're hoping that the roof isn't more than we paid for it last time but basically like that's just what's going on you want to look in here there isn't even anything in there does anybody clean this I mean, they must. This hole wasn't here. This is a fig. The fig tree. Yeah, I almost died. I hope it gives figs. I love figs. My mom has a fig tree. I steal her figs. Why are you sticking your nose in there? What's in there? Let me see. Let me see. I don't see anything. What do you smell? What do you smell, Nazi? My dog's weird. She smelled something, though. So, just let her. Anyway, just let her go when she do. Uh, so I'm only going to be doing a few vlogs like this uh, really nothing interesting happens so whenever something interesting happens that might affect commissions in the future I'm going to vlog about it let you guys know about it so that you know so that it's known I'm going to sit down 
Sit down right, right next to this weed. Um, uh, basically, like the roof, since we don't know how much that's going to cost, I'm hoping to get more commissions so that if my husband's paycheck can't cover it, I can help cover the other half. <sighs> Hope this doesn't affect any future plans. The dog left me. Well, there she is. Um, what happened? Did something attack you in there? Uh, yeah, so basically I'm not going to be doing a lot of these vlogs anymore. But I am going to be doing some. I'm also planning... Yes, can I help you? <laughs> Mochi? Mochi? Um, I'm also planning on eventually getting a new camera because this one, it only records for 9 minutes for some reason, even though it has a big SD card in it. It only records for 9 minutes, so if I want to do a time lapse, I can't do that. I would have to use my cell phone and just fill up the SD card on that, and I don't want to do that either, so I'm not sure. If I'll be able to do cool time lapses anytime soon. But, um, I do know that these, these, um, vlogs aren't going to be uploaded as, as often, and nor are they going to be uploaded as, um, on any schedule. It'll just be whenever I have something to say record it, I'll edit it, and probably the next day I'll upload it. Um, what else did I want to say? I wanted to say how, um, because I'm not going to be doing vlogs anymore, I'm going to be trying to do gaming videos. Um, uh, probably just, uh, dicking around in Stardew Valley and playing Slime Rancher. Like, I want to replay Slime Rancher from the beginning, just to get everything correct. But first... I need to get into the vaults, which means I need to get the vault cracker, the, the black one. Uh, we'll see about that. And Mati, what you doing over there? You have no business in the other building. So that's going to happen eventually. And um, I'm also... I'm hoping to get some new games, see if we can do that. And the podcast is hopefully going to be coming back, so I need to do a video. Well, not a video. I need to record audio for that. I'll probably do a video. I'm going to see if I can do a video without it completely, like, overheating my phone or my computer. I'm going to see if I can record with this camera from and record it to my computer. We'll see if we can do that, if my computer can do that. Right now my computer's being just... Uh, it's not good. I need to take it to be fixed, but I can't be without it, so until I get a new computer, I can't get this one fixed. Uh, it's just a whole bunch of things. So, my birthday is this month. So we'll see about what's going to go on with that. This Friday is Friday the 13th, so that's going to be spoopy. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say. I'm going to rip this weed out. You want to see it? He's dead now. And you put it on the concrete so it dies properly. Something bit me. But yeah, so basically, um, I am, we are going to start doing the podcast again. It is possible that I'll have to do the first few episodes by myself because my... Mati! Mati! Mochi!
because my co-host uh, doesn't have a schedule, so we don't know when we're going to be able to record. But we'll see about that. I probably will record a video for the podcast about where we have been and what's going on and what we're going to do, so I have to write talking points about that. But that's a thing that's going to happen, and so you can look forward to Sex Nerd Furries making a return, hopefully this month, and it'll probably be a once a month thing until we can get a good schedule going, and then I can do it once, like two times a month, and then hopefully once a week, which my goal is to get once a week, but it'll probably be bi-monthly. There's just time. It isn't a thing. And if I can get more co-hosts so that I can get more time slots, that'd be great. I already have two people that want to do this with me. So there will be at least two other co-hosts for different topics. And I have a whole bunch of topics that I want to talk about because I have matured in the fandom. And the fandom has changed and I really, really, really want to get into this juicy shit. So, those are things that are going to happen. I'm going to go back upstairs. I'm going to see about making that... Were you? I'm going to see about making that... uh, Basically, talking points for the podcast. And... You guys will see how successful that is. So, subscribe to Sex Nerd Furries. Because that's going to be out. Hopefully by the end of the week. Hopefully. Cross fingers. Whoa! I almost died and it was your fault. I guess my computer crashed last night while I was trying to do updates. This is just what it's been doing. It'll just crash. Just because it feels like it. We'll see how long it takes. All I wanted to do was edit my vlog. Okay, so I just recorded the first podcast for the Sex Nerd Furries podcast, and I'm hoping that it turned out really good. I'm not sure. I don't know how to feel about it. Um, I also recorded another episode of Stardew Valley, and my computer crashed, so we'll see if anything's saved. I'm going to check after the video renders. I have to wash dishes, so... Let's do that. So the guys who are putting the waterproofing on our roof are here. They've been here for a couple of hours. Originally we had four buckets of waterproofing solution. Solution, it's like a paste. But um, apparently the three buckets weren't enough we had to buy another bucket and then just now they told us that that fourth bucket had less material in it than the other three buckets so my husband had to go buy another bucket and some really expensive buckets are about a hundred dollars each and we do not have that money so we're using the credit card and we don't want to use a credit card but I mean they're already doing the work so we might as well just do it um, I mean, I, they're doing a decent job, I guess. I haven't gone up there myself. I'm wearing a skirt. Um, so maybe I'll put pants on later and, and jump up there when my husband goes up to check and take videos so you guys can see how white it is going to be. But they said that because it's so dry and the the roof has been without proper care for so long that it's basically just absorbing all the material. So my husband just so like I said my husband went to go buy another bucket and we're waiting for the main contractor to come back while the other two are still working. Um I mean they're they're working really fast. They've been here for about 
one. They got here at like 1030. So they've been here about three hours and they're almost done. So they work real fast and, they, and if they do a good job then that's awesome. I mean they were recommended to us so let's hope that works. And this girl even though they've come up and down the stairs several times, she keeps barking at them, don't you? We love it. They're up there. And my husband gets home, I'll see if I can see them from the ground floor. There they are, putting material on our roof. I took a video of the sky for a little bit, sorry. Ran out of way. Hey, no! Mochi! Leave alone, pass, Mochi! We ran out of weight, so... Putting on red. Okay, I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see it, but it's. Do you see anything? I don't wanna go any higher. Okay, so they left and. He guarantees it for five years. So if in five years it doesn't work, I'm gonna let you guys know. So this is going to be basically the time capsule that is going to tell us whether or not it lasts for at least five years. Let's hope for no leaks. Where he was alive and active as the guild master. On top of that, he also told us about many sites regarding the adventure of the origin. He readily told me to call him as instead of Ace Noble, and in the end, <laughs> I felt like I could...